Printing images from files provided by customers can be problematic due to file format settings and other format specific issues that may develop. With Wasatch Port Redirector, you can print an image from its native application, so there's no need to compromise on quality by exporting to a file type that may not yield the results you're looking for. Wasatch Port Redirector works by printing through a PostScript printer driver connected to a Windows port that outputs files directly to an output folder of your choice. Once installed, the Wasatch Port Redirector allows you to print from any application that is already on your system. When used in conjunction with hot folders, the Wasatch Port Redirector becomes a powerful and fully automated printing solution. This video will show you how to install and use the Wasatch Port Redirector. Navigate to the Port Redirector folder on your Wasatch Softrip installation CD. Select the type of system you're using. Double click the setup icon. Click Next. Click OK. You are now going to add a new port to connect to with your printer. Select the Add New Port button. Enter in your port name. Click Browse to navigate to a folder where you wish your files to be printed to. Click Next. Choose No, I'll install a driver manually from this window. Click OK. Select your control panel. Choose Printers. Select Add a Printer. Select Add a Local Printer. Choose Use an existing port and select the port you just installed. Click Next. Select the Have Disk button. Select Browse and navigate to your PPDs folder on your Wasatch Softrip install disk. Choose your operating system. Select the printer.inf file. Click OK. From the list of devices now available, choose your device. Click Next. Type in or adjust the printer name. Make your choice on printer sharing across the network. Click Finish. Now you're ready to print using the port redirector from any application on your system. With an image open, choose File and Print. From the printer pull-down list, select the printer you just installed. Select Print. You can now open the file that was generated directly in Wasatch, or you can use a hot folder to automate the process.